when I'm designing fabrics, one of the things I like to look at are vintage quilts to see how prints are used in the past and which prints really tell a story and read in the great kind of uh, conglomeration of prints that are patchwork, particularly the scrappy ones that I like, uh, end up being. So um, I like to collect. Uh, when I see an inter interesting vintage quilt in a market or a festival, I like to buy it, bring it home, and bring it out now and then and study it uh, to see what it's like. What I like particularly are very scrappy quilts, but that have a very simple structure. And yet that simple structure is telling you a wonderful, complicated story. And this is a very good example of it. Spiderweb, um, we get wonderful sort of pie-shaped uh, sections of multi patterned uh, things. And they're, very often these will be done just with long straight stripes uh, of fabric sewn together and then chopped up, uh, put together. But this one has interesting angles. So we're seeing, you know, sometimes very, very odd angles at things. So there's that complication to it. But also just the way they chose the colors what background would you choose for something like this? Often, when I come across vintage quilts, they're white backgrounds or, you know, off-white, sort of calico. And I think, oh, that's not so interesting. But this was fascinating, the way this sweet candy pink was used as a ground for this particular um, uh, recipe of color. What I find really interesting is when occasionally they pick something quite close, like, like this color melts into the pink. So it's sort of fleshy color, little print. So that's interesting. Some of the ones that don't quite contrast enough, but mostly there's a high contrast. And there's a predominance of blue in this quilt which holds it together. This wonderful, fresh kind of gulwaz blue is beautiful, I think. Um, and then shots of green and red now and then, yellows uh, kind of pop out and a very soft kind of mint green. But it's just a lovely palette that holds together, but has a wonderful kind of jazzy, contrast as well. So a beautiful balance of color and fabrics, uh, prints, you know, so I'm, the, the print world is something that totally fascinates me. And I'm, I think this is a wonderful example. The more I look at it, the more I get from it. The British Quilt Study Group is one of five varied special interest groups available for Guild members to join. Visit our website at quiltersguild.org.uk to find out more.